What is happening, y'all? Welcome back. So, uh, a couple changes. I think we got this now. Um, I added on lightning resist. I wasn't using my magic enough, so I added on dodge distance to help dodge his shitty lightning blast. And, and I figured out something. So, I was having a lot of problems with his parries. Essentially, like, you know, I'd parry him, and I wouldn't get a parry. And I figured it's because you can't do it on the return. Like right now, can't parry that. When he initially comes at you, you can parry it. Parry, one, two, three. Basically, he's gained too much momentum after he's turned around. So if he's turned around, you can't get a parry. It did take a couple practice attempts to get this down, but now... Fucking world of difference, right? the one thing I haven't figured out is when he's going to do that versus his regular old follow-up swing. And you're dead. With healing to spare. Pretty obnoxious fight, but a uh, Taranto, my sister. Uh, ooh. Plea to the storms. Toned by dry throats, calls forth blazing rays to pierce the clouds. That sounds so, so useful. Yes, I can finally kill obnoxious ass ghosts. Actually, let's go rest real fast, get our stuff back, but Yeah, definitely, definitely a fight that uh is a fantastic example about pattern recognition. I'm still not sure on what the I, I didn't pay enough close attention to know when he was gonna do the the slam lightning volley versus just the big swing, but still got it waste. Accidental button presses. I feel my blood turning into black sap. A 
and my aged skin into reddish bark. Okay, that was kind of a uh, weird, weird, and uh, really. Except, oh, you know what? That might have been the the tree guy. Tree guy. The only reason I know about the tree guy. Hang on a second. Let's see if there's a. The tree guy has to do with the the oil quest. Like you're supposed to get a thing, and give him oil. But um. I didn't, uh, I didn't do that quest, so. I mean, I thought, like I said, I think it's only a blue two-stern ring. Anyway. Those have removed from punishment were Perpetua and Esdras. Counting siblings who went on to be part of His Holiness's guard. Speak to your brother after death. Twisted to the paths of the miracle. Yeah, well, they're dead now, so. In a whole new area. Patio of the Silent Steps. Oh shit! Oh fuck you, game. That was cheeky. That was some top, top tier, fucking cheeky bullshit right there. Couldn't even make that jump. I don't know if I can make that jump. Let me just try. Yeah, nothing to lose. My God, that was almost even cheekier. I think I can. No, you know what? I looking at that. Hmm. Let me try. I might be able to reset. If, if it resets, I want to try like a slide into a jump, basically. No, it doesn't. All right, so quite literally, I'm not meant to get that right now. It sucks. Hit it later, probably. Because there was a door up top, so you probably come through on the inside. Damn, what is up with this load? I don't think we've had a load this long the entire game. Even the game start. I think it might have froze. I mean, it's spinning, but... I think we've had hmm hmm we're gonna alt f4 that probably could have waited longer but i mean that's th this game's transitions are usually instant loads are usually you know five seconds maybe 10 something was up with that Yep, definitely something. Oh, come on! Game, that was a good jump. Can I just take the bottom path? Hey. 
So I could go bottom or mid path. Enemies also die if they hit the spikes, it looks like. I had a feeling that was gonna fucking break. No! Oh my god, that's fucking obnoxious, dude. These areas are, are designed, apparently, to the point where if you are even a fucking pixel of a jump off, you're not gonna make it. God damn it. There's been, I mean, we've, we've overcome every bit of bullshit this game has thrown at us, but this may be it. Perfect jump. Perfect jump. Gotta make these grunting noises while I jump, because otherwise I won't make it. Can't come up here. Only cool kids can come up here. Yo! That was some straight up cheating. Next, it's wear from damage through contact. Oh my god, yes. I need the muted bell back on too. Um. Let's see, I have defense. Well, I guess I could get by without the. Oh, I have that on. What am I missing? Oh, I'm missing my, um, missing this guy. distance and that's dodge cooldown Before I use that, that where are the olive seeds? Relics quest. Oh, here they are. Yeah, so they're for the healer people. It's just to return through. gonna break I'm just gonna start jumping like everything I touch just jump just assume I need to jump ah. 
God. Definitely hit this with some good timing. Please give me a new resting spot. This guy again. One, heed my confession. Cowardice take who are we pilgrims, if not sinners? Oh, let my bend. Oh god. This looks like ass. Dude, it's gone. Monster's Those dead. Screams, thou hast purge, might have chosen different oh, roads. So still absolution but awaits still the end of the path. Absolution, merciful be the Big toe. I got the bird toe. Please tell me it's like dodge iframes. That's extra thrust while in the air. mark on the secret routes adds extra thrust. Well? So if I jump, I land like right there. I guess it's supposed to be distance. Hang on. I have no idea what the fuck this thing is. Big toe of limestone. Uh, big toe of limestone. Blasphemous. See if people know what the hell. There we go. What does big toe of made of limestone actually do? Everything it's saying is useless. Um, if you jump, hold down, and slash attack in air, you get a very small height boost. It allows you to get two more hits in. If you equip this toe, jump down after you get into the air and attack you get two little boosts while hitting an enemy it effectively gives you four attacks in the air it's explained if you go under the gameplay tips section in the menu huh well if i if i happen upon an opportunity where i need to get multiple multiple air of these asshole Actually, that's probably designed for guys like that. I have dodge, 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 defense, defense, and toe slaps. Hold on. It's supposed to be in the gameplay tip section. Very counterattack, we did that. Execution. Press down X while in air to ascend after hitting an enemy. You can do this the two times before landing. Hold up, what other gameplay tips are there? Dash, prayers and fervor, Prydean, May Culpa. Flasks, accumulation of guilt, sword hearts, rosary, children of moonlight, blood presence, inventory map, relics. Down X while in air to ascend after hitting an enemy. So like that. And if I have my toe on.
All right, so the toe lets me get a fourth hit in when I'm doing that as opposed to just getting three hits. I could see that being useful. Niche, very niche cases where it would it would work, but as long as I'm fighting flying guys, it's like it'll be helpful. And there's other areas here. Out of, oh, what are you? The knot of the three words. Here is where the first miracle took place. One devout and tormented, right, well, he placed a, a wooden, wooden log where he sat and prayed. He prayed, he prayed, prayed for pain, he could with the guilt. The pain, it made roots grow and twist over his arm. Every inhabitant of this land bore witness to it. This triune tree that sprouted years after his death was named the Knot of the Three Words. For three Every year from its core. Golden burning liquid perpetuate his memory, perhaps to remind us. Will be the path to the miracle. Yes, and there's some I feel like those are gonna hurt a lot if I let them hit me. Not of three words, mother of mothers. All right, well, since we're at, we we have gone through the patio of silent steps, the mother of mothers, and we're now we're at a whole new zone. So let's let's wrap up here, even though we're only in like 20 minutes. And then uh, we will do this mother of mothers thing in the next part. So stay tuned. I'll see you guys soon.